Okay. Today I'll be doing a request review for the Transformers movie All Spark Powered Stockade. Um, I just got them the other day with them um, with Big Daddy, which I reviewed. Um, but anyway, Stockade is a Sector Seven SUV. As you can see, it has the Sector Seven logo on it. Um, as you see, you see these in the movie, the drive. Um, and this looks pretty good. Um, see the main robot parts you see in this mode is underneath it, the legs. But underneath it's pretty kind of like hollow, as you can see. Um, but it's not kind of the bottom, the top. You know, looks really good. Um, it has the window. The windows are clear, sort of. You can kind of see through them, but you know, you don't see nothing. Just car parts. Well, not car parts. Um, robot parts. The top has the uh, sunroof kind of clear too and in the back it's clear see just more parts and these actually open but you know just more robot parts um let's see the front has a little Decepticon logo there and the headlights um and it rolls really good I might as well say for this moment except for, you know, it's Sector 7 SUV. But, um, so I'll just guess I'm just going to go into transformation. Transformation is not too hard. You just start off pulling the front down here. Pull this door. Pull the, show you this, pull the lower half of the door. Up. Out. That. Just pull this, same thing on the other side. Out. Then you just turn the whole front and just do the back, the legs, fold the feet out, the back piece out like that. Same thing here. That. Then you go back to the top and just take this whole section and fold it out. That. Separate the legs. This little piece here. Count. Turn up a little bit. Then you just kind of separate the lower arm from the upper arm. And same thing here. And fold this piece out. Piece out. And then you just fold this piece here. If you activate this auto morph, I guess so you can say that. And the head just pops out. That. Um. And to stand up. And there is Stockade. Um, you know, as you can see, he is part of the AllSpark line, which has the AllSpark blue color in it on his arms and the legs and the little bit on the chest. But, um, but Stockade, though, he looks really cool, though. Um, let's see. Uh, what's safer? Um, just I guess as you go into his posability, the arm goes all the way around, out, um, bend to the elbow, goes back. It doesn't bend all the way back, but it doesn't matter. I mean, elbow's not supposed to bend all the way back. But you have two joints, one up here on the arm and one in his elbow. So he has two parts where you can bend there. It's pretty cool. Um, same with the other arm. He does have waist posability. Well, Waste pulsability, which is really cool. Turn all the way around. So you can do like a punching action too. Um, See so the legs goes out, forward, back. Bends at the knee. Doesn't doesn't turn at the knee though. Um, See so the foot goes up and down. That's it. The head. Um, it can look. It can look. It doesn't really look up. Look down a little bit. Kind of goes. Tilted side to side. Doesn't go all the way around, just kind of goes side to side. Um, let's see. His hands have uh, some pull ability. Not, not the wrist, but like in finger. But the uh, little the hand opens, and he has, he has these two. See, it looks like he has four with the um, four fingers here, but it's just that two fingers make one big finger, so he has like. So it's like having two fingers that they, they can pose 
individually. I mean, they don't point straight out. They're still curved, but they do. Actually, it's hard to see. Just like that. Okay. Um, one problem with this guy is that he has no weapons. Um, instead of having a weapon, he has a little gimmick, kind of like barricade. He has this piece here that was on top of the um, the vehicle mode. You pull it back, and then the the hand comes out like that. Like that. Same thing does in the other arm too. Kind of like a punching action because he's more of a brawler. Punch all the Autobots. Um, whatever. I mean. Okay, so it's just like Barricade, you know what I mean? You know, Barricade didn't have any weapons, he just had a spring-loaded punch. He doesn't have a spring, it's just you pull this back and this goes forward. Um, whatever. The thing is, his hand's open, so you can possibly give him a weapon. I do have something for him, I guess. Just, well. There, I gave him a lightsaber. Then you kind of fold this over his hand, too, like maybe a little thing maybe to punch harder or something, I don't know. Okay. Um yeah. take that out now. Um I don't know, when I first heard about this guy, I don't know. I thought he was in Autobot. I don't know. Sorry. But then yeah, but he is the Septicon there. He had the Septicon logo right there on his leg. Um just kinda spin him around. From the, from the back, just have detailing right here under these plates, kind of thing on his back looks cool. Then you got these big car parts on his back of his legs. But um, anyway, um, but it still looks cool, you know. Detail, got detailing all around. I like guess head molds pretty cool. The way his head's designed. Um, well, he has a punching punching action, so I have to test something. I've done this with all my transforms out of punching action, barricade, ransack, no not ransack, um, oh, why, why did I say that? I meant long rack. No, got him. Frenzy. Let's see if this works, I haven't really tried it. Let's take the punching, just want to make sure you see this. Just take the punching, make sure I do this right. Nope. See, his arm doesn't go out that far, so i got to make sure I'm kind of close. There. His punching action is not all that strong, really. So, that, there's to show you. Because when I did it with Barricade, Frenzy flew. When I did it with Long Rack, he flew. Well, Cybertron Long Rack. Also, because they were, they were like, spring-loaded. Him is just... So, it's not, it's not a very strong punch. But, um... But, whatever. Um... Let's see, what else do I have to say about this guy? Um, hmm. I don't know. I guess I'm just going to get on this final score. Um, this guy, the pose ability is pretty good. I mean, you got waist pose ability, arm pose ability is pretty good, and the legs. Um, vehicle mode is pretty cool. His robot mode is really cool. I mean, it looks cool. Um, one problem is the, um, no weapons, but he still has the punching action, which is, eh, it's alright. But, um, but whatever. I s um let's see, what should I give him? Um, I'll just give him an eight point five. It's just the lack of weapons and I don't know, the punch is not that strong, like to make Frenzy fly, which is what I liked about Barricade and but, uh, Long Rack from Transformers Cybertron. But um but yeah, if you do find him, I do recommend them. I mean you'll probably like them. Um so yeah, I give him an eight point five. And then, uh, oh yeah, I forgot to mention, I do have a new Transformers you got yesterday. I got, um, Transformers movie Jolt, which is another Walmart exclusive I just got, uh, yesterday, just to let you know. But, um, but anyway. So yeah, a final score for this guy is an 8.5. Transformers, um, give Stockade an 8.5.